After having the most fabulous perspective of three days last year, it's the first to go on the calendar this year. Unfortunately, an unseating at uh, two, therefore Megan Elphick. So just be aware there is a loose horse just running back to the start. Oh honey, that's not the luck we wanted to Hi see. Hi guys, welcome to this week's video. Come around with a little bit of uh, oh, oh yeah. honey. Did I, did I do the yeah. right? Yeah. Oh, oh yeah, you did. You didn't yeah. really. Nice. Down space. Oh Jumped. dear, oh dear. Yeah. We will debrief better later, guys. But let's just talk you through the injuries. So we'll start from the bottom. Been studded there, studded there, and studded there. It's nice. Nice. Um, You're not wearing a skirt tonight, then. Yeah, and I'm not allowed to drink because they've already got concussion. I'd well, the word I could have concussion. Um, these are fine. These are just a little grazy. We're, we're grateful the ground's actually soft. Yeah, and then the face apparently is not looking its best. Yeah, we've got we've got a little something going on there, and we're not sure the nose is a bit swollen there. That's going to come I'll up. Break I break my nose. Maybe my even career's a little over. Graze there, so yeah. <laughs> teeth, teeth are all good. That's one of the things I was like. Yeah. <laughs> Put your tongue over them. Yeah. Um, yeah. Basically. And jam is fine. Jamie is jam, jump the start box. I don't and think then the string. Video. And then, then the string. And then no, almost. I don't know if anyone would have filmed because everyone was so worried oh, yeah. to try and get her. I think Equiril may have that goal. Yeah, she went straight yeah. to the road. Yeah. Um, yeah, and then we thought she was going to jump the, the fence big. to the uh, road. That. She could yeah. jump. She was fine, actually, then, mate. Yeah, she was all right. Yeah. Wow. She was making her own cross country course. Yeah. On the way back to D. Anywho, yeah. Expect that. Completely my fault as well, guys. Which is. Good. It's, it's actually good. I'd rather be my fault than Jam's fault. And these things happen, and unfortunately, these that's part happen. of the sport. Plus, I was due another fall because I blew up after. So make sure you like, comment, subscribe. <laughs> Thanks. Little graze for the perfect GD. Although she's going right by this string, but I'm scared it's gonna like she's gonna put her head up and hit it. So I'm having to look like, push it right out the way. Hey, GD, can you not go so close to the string? Thank you. Look, all oh, these people also hand grazing. Too many people here. Yeah. But yes, having a well deserved little leg stretch and munch, aren't we? Because you're a very, very clever girl, DD. Yeah, are you going to tow me now to the next bit that you like? Oh, I'm impressed. You found that one bit quite quickly. Oh, you've had a little roll, have you? Beautiful ponies. Maggie is up there walking Jammy very far away in the other direction. So they don't know they're here. Hi, hi, hi! Hi! So, all good. Poor Bam Bam has studded herself up here. I think, probably, right at the start, before we even went down, because she tries so hard to tuck her little leggies in. So, we've antiseptic sprayed it, cleaned it all off. Taken her for a walk and a graze. I'm feeling better after having a walk and not a graze. <laughs> yeah, you totally had a graze. I totally had, had a graze. A little crep. Yeah, I had a disappointing crep, actually. Yeah. Um, so yeah, that is the plan of action. I'm feeling fine at the moment. I just need to keep on top of... The main thing they're worried about is if I've got like mild concussion. Um, so yeah, I always get headaches though. So, they were so like, how would you headaches? know? Like, so how would you know? But apparently being sick, dizzy, okay. talking rubbish. They're like, just like get people that you know to like watch you tonight in case you do anything weird. That's on you, that is That's Peter. On um, so yeah, check check I know she does that. a lot of weird things, but check if she's anything abnormally. If I'm abnormal. not weird, I think yeah, that's when you talk. need to worry. That would be weird. Um, I'm not going to go to the party tonight. I'm not allowed to drink because that's not good if I do have concussion. You probably shouldn't really walk around on it. Should shouldn't walk around. My legs are quite sore. But Hanny Banani is going to go to the party. I'm going to party, party for three of us. For everyone. <laughs> and then I'm hoping I'll still be able to jump D tomorrow. My face really hurts, like here. Yeah, mate, you're. And here. It's not a pretty sight, I'm not gonna lie. So let's just zoom in on that. <laughs> let's just. Mmm. <laughs> and I've still got mud in my teeth. I was literally like. Oh. <laughs> do it. I wanna watch it. I'm gonna try and find Equibril. You guys have probably already seen it. So comment down below if yeah, that's can spectacular. I see it? Yeah, but as soon as I get it, I could have seen it with my own eyes, couldn't I? I was right there. Yeah. And I just You could have had the blimmin' live show, man. Uh, I could have had the live show. Well, 
And I, and I thought, right, well, I'm going to run down because Jeanette's not. So I pegged it down there. I wasn't even going to go down. Pegged it down and I didn't film too because I had to peg it back In up fairness, the top. you don't expect anything interesting to happen at two. Well, I wasn't even looking, Meg. I was literally running at the top and someone was yeah. like, catch jam, catch jam. I was like, what? Huh? I'm Turn done. around. Oh, there's a horse running. Have I told the vlog that she done the start box yet? I, I so. really Think have, stupid but let's tell this one. Apparently, tell this one. it was spectacular. Oh my god, mate, you didn't. Even, you, I forgot the start box there. She was just like gallop, 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 ping, gallop, so gallop, gallop, ping drive, of the road. So I think gallop, we know gallop, gallop. Whose, whose fault it was. We fell. Uh, and no. the string. Anywho, yeah, the string. Jamie's looking good. So yeah, that is the plan of action now. I'm gonna shower myself off, and you stink. Yeah, just you also out. need to wash off your body protector and your like air jacket, jacket and your... You need a new hat. I need a new hat. Oh, you liked that hat as well. I love that hat. I'm hoping Champion will say have the exact same hat. Yeah, that'll be nice. Um, and yeah. Anyway, Good don't see life. rubbish strides. <laughs> At least you get to wear it. You can wear it. You've got your other one. Yeah, Before, yeah, yeah. Before, you didn't have that one. You only had the one. I know. And you'd have been buggered. I would have. You'd have to go and buy one from that shop. I bet they would yeah. have We'd have to go to that tax shop. We would. We'd have to go there. Yeah. But thankfully, we don't need to do that. <sighs> Nightmare. Right, my arm's aching now, so. All right. Live, love, live, love. Live, love, love. See you later. Good morning, everyone, and welcome to the final day of Victon. Yeah, and the sun is shining. <laughs> the sun is shining down on the righteous. The righteous or the righteousness? Righteous. Yeah. Yeah. Down on the righteous. Burns the wicked, shines on the righteous. Yeah. Exactly. Anywho, so. Woken up actually feeling surprisingly well. I am a bit bruised. It's hardly showing up. Um, I'm one of those people that doesn't really bruise. And in this situation, I think I'd look a lot cooler if I was one of those Stop people that did it. bruise. It's such a pain. No, I'm joking, I'm joking. Um, but in all seriousness, I've put a lot of thought into whether I'm riding or not today, because obviously I still have my show jumping with Dee. Um, and I know in the equestrian community there's quite a stiff upper lip, just get back on kind of thing. Um, but you have obviously got to make sure you're all right. Like my legs are bruised, that's not really what I'm worried about. The main thing was my head. Um, but I've hardly had a headache or anything. I feel very it's coherent. Because the you've been looked after. Right? Yes. <laughs> um, but I'm going to take it all one step at a time. Like if I can get my hat and boots on without too much pain, then I'll ride around, see how I'm feeling, and do it like that. Anyway, Jam Bam, are you rubbing your bum? You naughty girl. We're going to get this girlie out for a quick graze, and then I need to plait up for the trot up. Han's going to trot her up for me because I think I wouldn't pass. As in trot Didi up, not trot Jam Bam up. Jam looks grumpy today. Are you sore? Oh, I do feel really bad for you. Right. Good morning. I'm playing groom today. So, I've already said good morning. Hello again, guys. Um, obviously, hands trotting her up. Although, I think I would be fine to do it. It was more, I can't face getting my bruised legs out because I was going to wear hands dress that she's now wearing. Um, and you know, it's a bit embarrassing if you <laughs> trot it up a bit lame, as in the rider lame. Anywho, we're just platting. Pete can come show the plaits. I'm doing band plaits because I had about seven minutes to do them. Well, that's not going to be a good angle. I know, I'm trying it. to. Yeah. Go. Guys, Pete doesn't understand the angle. Don't, don't worry. Well, Dee's in the way, I can't. You have to go round her bum. I'm not going round the back. It's dangerous. <laughs> Anyway, that's the update. We'll, no, you're annoying her now. Get that camera. We'll see you at the trot up. Get some nice. How will get some nice footage? A bit jelly. Oh well. Right. See you there, guys. Okay. Han having a little practice. Just watch her on the turn, Han. Good girl. Good. Good girl. Yeah. I'm gonna put your shoes yeah. on. Yeah. Okay, we're having a shoe change. Hello. Hold me up. Okay. So you walk around the outside of the window. Yeah. Yep. Oh my gosh, she's got a long dress on. <laughs> she's fearless. I am fearless. Hang on, Jeanette. I'm gonna stress. Hang on. You look very nice. You look very, very nice. You look lovely. Thanks, be stressing slightly. All right. There you are, boo. Yeah. D, that's my painful arm. Good girl. Okay. Good then. Good girl. Oh my god, her tail's puffy. Oh no. 
Hopefully Pete's in position, she is. Oh yes, good girl Dee Dee. Hands first trot up. <laughs> and explaining the, uh, the issue, why she's trotting up. So this is number 309, Comfort <laughs> Delight, owned and ridden by Megan Alfick, but being trotted up by her incredibly helpful groom. <laughs> Damn straight. Watching what they're calling show jumping, but to be honest, is more like I don't know a new sport of jumping in water. Can you hear the horses' hooves? It is so wet, but the horse is actually jumping really quite nicely at the minute, which is good. So just learning the course. I've got just over an hour until I jump. Nerves are starting to creep in a little bit, but I'm I'm feeling completely fine. I've just got the normal <laughs> that sound, the normal show jumping nerves. So obviously trusty Y food is here. I've got the strawberry lassie today. I think I've had a different flavour every day. Which I think is, you have. It's quite good, isn't it? Um, so yeah, this is going to be fantastic for sipping away at, getting me nice and full and not feeling weak because I do need to make sure that I'm actually riding properly, especially after yesterday. So sip this, hopefully feel nice and full. Remember, if you want to use it, you can use code ELFIT dash YouTube, Elphick hyphen YouTube, and get yourself 10% off. They are absolutely fabulous for competing. The lorry stash has severely gone down, so I'll have to replay that when I get home. Anyway, I'm gonna watch some show jumping. nice thing about not caring how you look today is you can do vlogging bits with your hair net on like this. I just want to show you this before I show jump. My last little confidence boost. So this is my poor hat from yesterday. I need to wash my lovely super cross country cover and then my air jacket which did go off and help me. It didn't actually look as muddy as I thought it was going to look. It's the back, yeah. Back, and that shoulder, yeah. that's why that hurts. Yeah. It's like playing a detective game, seeing where the mud is, and then being like, oh, so that's why that hurts. I must have fallen that way. Anywho, thankfully, I have my champion hard peak hat. So I'm not re-riding in that hat. That is going to, sadly, not be ridden in again. Because obviously, once I've had a fall, don't want to that's ride really in that again. That's really lucky, though, that you've got that. Isn't it? Isn't it? Forever. I know. It does make me think I should probably chuck my yard hat in. Yeah. I mean, I go with two hats, but... But just in case. Yes. Anyway, it's getting a bit rushed now, so I will see you guys once I'm warming DDF, I imagine. It's showtime, Veronica. Hey. It's showtime, Veronica. Come on, Veronica, you can do this. Come on, Veronica. Oh, run, run, run. Hey, DD, you keen? I think she's yeah. a bit keen now. Yeah, I think she remembers from last year what's coming. Yeah. Excited. At least she has done this three-day format a couple of times before. Yeah. Jammy would have been like, what? <laughs> what are you doing? Mate, you're um, fully dressed in Aztec today. Aztec coat and Aztec leggings. Oh, yeah. Well, this is my dress-up. My dress-up? My dressage dress-up. <laughs> yeah. It was. Right. Looking good, looking good. Live, laugh, love. Okay. Yep. Hey guys, I just wanted to quickly jump in with a voice over here. Firstly, you can see the arena is so flooded, so I was already anxious about warming up. It's a very small area to warm up, and it's basically all puddle. Um, but there's not really going to be much talking, <laughs> or any talking in this, because I genuinely felt like I was having a bit of a panic attack here, and 
you won't see all of the jumping because I was honestly just bawling my eyes out doing this. I was so petrified to go over those first few cross poles and yeah, just preempting a bit because I think my riding is a little bit kicky pulley for <laughs> the next minute or so, but that is sadly a consequence of having the fall the day before. Now we turn to the right of Megan Elphick. Megan brings forward this 12-year-old dapple green mare by Cocon Silver Bell. It's Commons Delight. Megan starts with a score of 31.6. Sorry guys, that was um... Oh, the sun, where shall I stand? Hey? Where shall I stand for the sun, where's better to the... Oh, I don't know. Yeah, I think that's um, a bit better, I can't really see guys, sorry. Not gonna lie, I was absolutely petrified to go in there, and then warming up, I felt like I couldn't even jump across the pole. Just, as soon as I turned to it, I just kept seeing that stupid stride yesterday. But, Dee was amazing, I was so pleased with her, and I'm really glad I made myself do it, because I knew if I yeah. jumped today, I was gonna really struggle to get over yesterday. Please. Epic, epic pony, hey. I think she's inside the time as well, wasn't she? Um, I don't know, Meg. I was too busy looking at you. <laughs> too busy crying. <laughs> Sorry, guys. Sorry, team. <laughs> Love it is. I just felt like literally my chest felt so mm. tight going in. I was like, I can't. Like, I need to go in. Yeah. Oh, honey. Oh, look at all this nice little mud on your horse, see? God. Well done, you did very, very well, alright. Oh, I love her so much. Yeah. She's so I can't talk to her. Maggie, you? Maggie, what's happening? We're going to Mammy Dead, we're going to Mammy Dead together! Woo! Stable mates. <laughs> oh, Dee Dee doesn't look like a mess. That's the one bit that doesn't hurt with my air jacket was. <laughs> oh. Well done, ladies. Well done. Well done. Oh. Oh. Well done. Well done, honey. He's so uninterested. Yeah, she's like, come on then. Like, Thanks, so Get me home, ready for badminton. Hi, Dee Who's wrong? 
the dice Still hoping to find a future for me Guys, you've heard of Friends, the reunion, <laughs> but have you heard of Dean Jam, the reunion? It's finally time. This has been partly what I've been most excited to film. Oh, really? Sure, I've got a polo in. Um, yeah, so obviously they kind of had an inkling they were here because they were whinnying, <laughs> but they the have night, not yeah. seen each other at all. So I think they've forgotten as well. Yeah, I think they have. You're going to go grab Jam Bam. I'm going to grab Dee Dee. Right, Pete's going to film. Meet you down the bottom, Hern. Hey. So who's oh, there's a lorry there. Yes, yes. I'm gonna go in the hand. Okay. Let me go see your gorgeous little buddy. Yes, we are. Are you excited? You actually don't have a clue. It's gonna make me cry again, realistically, guys, isn't it? What are you doing here? Ah! <laughs> you need to get out of the way. I thought that was gonna be a lot cuter. Look, she's like, as if you've ruined my fun! Oh, I know, I was VIP princess coming here. She's actually annoyed. Jam's like, oh, how did they? They didn't even recognise each other straight away, did no. they? I think they were so confused. You absolute melt. Wow, really? Dee is genuinely angry. Dee's so angry you fought Jammy. <laughs> She's been here the whole time, Dee Dee. She's like, Ugh. I thought I had it all to myself. Well, I thought that was going to be a lot more wholesome. Really was not. Righty ho, reunion done. Not quite as wholesome as I thought. So we're going to be heading off very shortly. Mum's just trying to get the lorry out of the uh, <laughs> quagmire. Um, I will do a little bit of a debrief on the way home, but we're not travelling home together. No. It's going to be weird. So Pete. <laughs> No, I don't want her in the lorry. It is better without because it's more space than in the front. Pete! Should we just take the car and he can go in the lorry? Yeah, shall we? So nasty. I can. Third party, innit? Um, yeah, because Pete drove down after work, we've got separate vehicles. So Hannah's going to be chief groom, go back with Hobbs and the, yeah, ponies. the ponies. We're going to trail behind. Ouch! Make sure that we are there in time. But very, very pleased with both ponies, to be fair. Um, yeah. We will have a little debrief about Jam Bam, but thankfully she's You're looking clever. really yeah. sprightly today, which is exactly what I wanted to see. Gorgeous gal. <laughs> Dee's a bit like, no, I'm top pony. Um, you are incredible, Dee Dee. You are. Yeah. But you moved up the rankings again. Very happy, aren't we, Dee? You're going to badminton, girls? Woohoo! Both of you! I'm working, I think. Oh, are you? I don't yeah, think you are. I think, I think you. I, I think you told me that you your shifts aren't even I on. I just text actually from my boss to say, Han, mate, we need to Han, actually. Got. Oh, you have to book that off. <laughs> She's coming. Good girl. You silly girl. Oh, oh dear, I didn't really film that. That's <laughs> 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 One job. Girls, I love you so much. I was worried that Pete was going to be run over. Driving home. Not my normal driving home debrief. However, I feel like the sounds may be better in here than in the big comfy lorry. It might, be. it might well be. So we're in oh, Mum's truck. Um, like I said, yeah, Pete drove down after work. But Bicton's over, baby. What an emotional roller coaster. I literally still feel so weird and up and down with emotions because as you guys saw I was well I thought I was gonna be fine going into show jumping like I knew I'd be worried but when I went in like when I was getting back it called into that like little arena bit suddenly started having like my heart was speeding up loads and I was like mm, that's a bit weird I feel a bit way like more nervous than normal and then trotting around going into trotting into that cross pole I literally I felt like my chest was closing up. I can't even breathe. I was so scared. I'd like a flash of the awful stride I'd put jam on the day before. And yeah, literally was a lot harder than I thought it was going to be, which is worrying me a bit going forward because that was obviously riding Dee Dee in the show jumping, something that like is a lot more comfortable than going cross country on jam. 
Um, anyway, we've got a winter. We'll stay positive. It'll be all right. I just keep crying. <laughs> I keep crying at people's comments as well. Why do you feel right now? I feel like I'm all cried out. Um, but absolutely buzzed with Dee Dee. So exciting. I've been trying to get that gorgeous little pony to badminton. You've done it. <laughs> I've done it. Done. But it's just been years. It's been a long time coming. And Jammy obviously qualified at Frickley. So they are both going in the 90, which after yesterday, I am incredibly thankful for um shout out to equireal because they sent me my footage so quickly and i have watched jams fall it's from behind so i can't exactly see how i fell but in a way it's made me feel better watching it although simon greaves gave me some amazing advice which was to not keep watching it he said limit yourself to watching it twice while your head's still all over the place like you can revisit it later on when you've gained your confidence but at the minute only like if you have to watch it only watch it twice my confidence is definitely i don't even know if it's my confidence it's just like i don't know i just felt I've, I've never had that feeling before there's like not feeling confident and then there was feeling scared and i felt scared today i don't normally feel scared on the horses anyway Still, I'm, I'm so pleased, and I'm so pleased with Jam. I just feel really guilty for putting her on that stride because I can, like, when I shut my eyes, I can visualize it, and I know it was too strong, it's too long a stride to ask her to do at that kind of fence. And I think the main issue was that we'd done steeplechases, which in hindsight, Jam's not doing again. It's not a good thing for her to do because she gets very excited jumping and it's not good to encourage her to go as fast as she can over fences that she can brush through. Um, so I think that was part of the problem. She was in steeplechase mode and she was thinking, get close and jump, you know, like flat. And I just saw a long one. I think all the mud that had been kicked up, she read the fence as a palisade because it was a bit shady there. I think she genuinely thought that she could just get in and she's such a trier, so she really throws her back end up. And like she, like she gets us out, but then, because she put her back end up so much and I'd already been like sent forward, I think. I just went over the top and then that threw her balance off more. We both go down. I got fully tangled in her reins, been trodden on. Like she was just trying to get off me and I remember being like this, just being like, oh my God, there's legs everywhere. Uh, but thankfully I had my 0.2 air vest on. So I'm actually fine all, everywhere my vest was. It's my arms, my legs, my head. Um, that was another issue, but we live to fight another day and I've got a whole winter now of just rebuilding our confidence. I'm gonna be very disciplined about not pushing ourselves. I'm, Jamie is gonna have a little bit of downtime after Victim before going to London to do the demo, which is gonna be another good thing for confidence. Um, but before she gets like turned away for a bit, I'm going to just jump over some cross poles at home, make it really easy and just build both our confidence and like our trust. I'm scared she's not gonna trust me anymore because it's just so stupid. She will. She will. I didn't, we didn't film because I literally just got out of being checked by um, the doctors and everything. But when I came back, I went to go and see her and oh, it melted my heart. She went crazy, like whinnying, wickering. Like she always wickers too, but she was literally like this, like kicking her door, screaming at me. And I was like, oh. Damn, you're melting my heart. Ah, oh, dear, oh dear. Right, I've been talking for a very long time. Thank you for everyone that has stuck with me throughout all of these three videos. They've been up and down. Big thank you to my amazing support team. Peter, the cameraman, Hobbit, Han, camera women, grooms pony carers, trotter uppers, everything. And Tina M and Cameron have been massive, massive helps as well. Like genuinely these, these stairway shows and these emotional journeys would not be doable without my lovely people around me. Very, very lucky. And a big thank you to the wonderful Y Food as well. We actually just stopped at Burger King and Mark. So I've had loads of 
naughty food, but until that point, I hadn't had anything but Y food this morning, and it really kept me going. I felt good going into show jumping, stomach wise, less so up here. Um, but no, Y food has been an absolute godsend this weekend. I don't know how many we've made it through. We went through a lot. I've been through multiple days. Because cross country day, I had two. Yeah, yeah. I had two cross country day, then I had one every other day. We've gone through a lot. I think you know, I need to restock that. But <laughs> if you would like to get yourself a lovely discount, you can use Elphic Dash YouTube. You guys will know the drill now. It'll be up on the screen. You can also just click the link below. It'll be a lot easier for you. <sighs> Big thank you to all of you for watching. Emotional goodbye. Eh? An emotional goodbye, and I'm gonna see you at Badminton next year with two great ponies. Right. I'm gonna live, laugh, leave now. <laughs>